All right. Ho, ho, ho. Welcome, everyone, to the seasonal special of Rinse and Repeat with the Shower Cap Kids. Everyone say hi. 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 Welcome. Oh, last night, I went down the stairs, right? It's the middle of the night because I hear rustling, right? And I look to my chimney. I rub my eyes, and it's Santa Claus. He's at my chimney. And uh, he gave me this sweet shirt, you know? Um, So now we all know who we are. Um, For Spotify listeners, uh, we got our shirts, and they have our names on it. So if you don't know by now, you're kind of out of luck. Not going to (laughs) lie. But uh, today, we're coming to you live from the super small shower at your grandma's house that you have to use because you're staying at her house for the holidays. Now, um, uh, just a disclaimer. I know we forgot to accomplish our uh, goal uh, last episode, which was to eliminate the national debt. But it's fine, you know, we'll get to it, you know, uh, after the holidays, it'll be fine. You know, wish wash, life gets in the way, but it's fine because we have another goal today that we have to accomplish. Would you like to know What's what it is? What's that goal? What is it? Thank you, Monster. Thank you. Our goal today is to help Santa by becoming elves on the shelves. I already am one, so No, okay. I can do that. <laughs> Those yeah, kind if, of creep me dude, out, though. I hey, always if you're, wanted to be one. If you're small enough, you could just sit and just... And just stare, Not but uh, that works. <laughs> yeah, and no. Hey. So I, I think I think we're gonna throw it over to Lemonade for some bubble bath banter. What do you guys think? Yeah. Let's do it. yeah. yeah. Yo, it's Lemonade, and this is bubble bath, bubble bath banter. This is where we all catch up and just like I don't know, find out one of us is like sick. Oh. Someone's at my door. <laughs> Did you say find out which one of us is sick? Stand by, stand by. This should definitely stay in the podcast. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's just everyone's mom walking in the back of the frame. Yo, I got my cat. My cat is in the frame, though. Yo, Oops. yo, 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 cat. Hey, she cat. wants to celebrate the holiday special with you. If you're ready, reset. Anyways, how are you guys? Oh, I'm doing are excellent. You? I don't care. Very good. Mind. Okay. <laughs> so. I just want to ask you guys, um, is it better to party all night and open presents on Christmas Eve, or is it better to open them the next day? If the eggnog's flowing, I'll be there, man. <laughs> Christmas Eve. Well, eggnog is disgusting. Okay. Eggnog. You guys, I don't open presents on Christmas Eve. I open them on Christmas Day. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. I open them on Christmas so Eve. We do both. The yeah. Is that a thing that people do? I do both. Why would you open yeah. Day before Christmas. Well, no, because you have to, like, uh, one day you have to go see, like, your mom's family. So then there's, like, yeah. two. You know what I mean? Yeah, oh, yeah, I used to do us. that. I used to do that with, like, um, my dad's side of the family would go and open them the day before. You know what I think's weird, though, is how people get presents in their shoes, like, like two weeks before Christmas. I, I, you I don't? don't I you don't? No. Yeah, no. you put your shoe I used out, to do that. And they give you stuff. Nothing I've belongs in that. shoes besides Doesn't feet. Doesn't it smell? No, it's I like rat shredders stuff. Do. Yeah, one time, um, I found out about what that was when I was like, I don't know, maybe eight or something, and I told my parents about it. I was like, "It's the Saint Nick's thing, and he's coming tonight." So I put my shoes by the fireplace, and they're like, "What?" So then they went and got candy canes from Walgreens at like twelve p.m. or a.m. <laughs> isn't real, sweet <laughs> noon, noon at the CVS. Yeah, real, though, right. <laughs> So every year my mom has always done this but i'm lactose intolerant so she purposefully <laughs> gives me milk chocolate so that <gasps> i'll open it all up be like oh I, I got chocolate thanks and then she'll proceed to eat it that's so she's bad. waiting for that. that's kind what? of smart that's, that's torturous. Torturous. Do that. deserve some cold. but that's all right because i get other presents like on christmas eve but like it's just the joke now that's grinch that's mentality so right there that, that is that is <laughs> Heart is Cream. three this times is small. This is Rody the Grinch. Yeah. For sure. <laughs> Dang. But how do you guys open your presents on Christmas Eve if Santa doesn't even come until Christmas Eve? Yeah, how do you get your presents before he even shows up at it's your like house? It's like your family's presents or yeah, something. Yeah, it's the family yeah. presents. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I see him every year. My dad disappears, and then Santa shows up, and then, yeah. That happens so. too? He looks a little bit like your dad, but it's fine because it's Santa. What? Yeah, what? exactly. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Art is influenced by the world around you, so maybe Santa just looks like everybody's dad. 
This is too I, deep I, for our child. Part part of of Santa 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 we're all Santa. Santa. Not really meta. Sometimes yeah. when I see strangers though, and they're like, you know, they're really old, they have beards. Sometimes like I, I stop myself from making fun of them because I think, what if I was in a Christmas movie and what if this person is Santa in disguise? So then, then I you don't. Get cold. You yeah, then I'll get cold. You would make fun of old people otherwise? <laughs> of course. Yeah. <laughs> if they week... don't look like Santa, then you'll make fun of them. Have Literally you met la- Shredder? <laughs> last week I was at the mall and there was this white bearded guy in like some uh, like uh, jean shorts and like long white socks. And I'm like, shorts. <laughs> and I was going to make fun of him, but I was like, wait, this could be a Hallmark movie. So then I just didn't. <laughs> it's the Hot Topic Santa. <laughs> Have you seen that mall? So they've looked so like frail and minuscule this year. The like, Santas at the mall oh this year are very thin. They're so tiny. Someone's <laughs> been treating Santa. To, like, Santa I, needs more yeah. food. Yeah. Santa got hit hard by the. COVID. He didn't get enough. Cause he's, <laughs> he's been, been working doing out some budget cuts on his meals lately. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah they've been watchers. trying the keto diet. Keto diet. <laughs> Oh are the how old were you when you stopped getting workers? your picture taken with santa i don't uh, think i ever ooh. did Ima- yeah, imagine, I. imagine santa goes to your bed and wakes you up and you're like what and he's like are these cookies gluten-free and they're like what, <laughs> I- <laughs> what? stop let me sleep he's on a new diet yeah. yeah no no but like i had this issue i could never fall asleep on christmas eve as a kid like i would stay up the entire night oh yeah no and never by choice either it no, was like always like, a thing that you couldn't control yeah, yeah i was just i got so anxious for some reason i was like oh my god he's downstairs and he's breaking into my house oh my something. god there's mm-hmm. this big red guy breaking into my house <laughs> oh my god i remember this one everywhere. time everywhere I literally almost peed myself in my bed because I didn't want to go to the bathroom because I was like, what if he's here right now? And then I accidentally <laughs> see him or something. So then I just held it. But that was a terrible night. What if you don't have <sighs> a chimney? He goes to the other thing. I don't he have a chimney. He's going to bust it down the front door. <laughs> yeah, he's Your door is window. off the yeah. you wake up. <laughs> in, my first, in my first house, we didn't have one. And my parents, I asked my parents, I was like, how is he supposed to get in? And they're like, uh, we gave him a key last week so he could get in, and I completely believe that. So he for, still has yeah. a key to your old house. See, <laughs> I don't have, house. I don't have one, but I have that little like gas pipe because everybody has a gas pipe. And so then I was like, of course. like where does Santa go? Like if there's no chimney, and they said through the gas pipe, <laughs> and the he gas pipe is like this big. <laughs> he like, yeah. a little bit. Yeah, makes sense. Did that you guys leave for carrots out for the reindeer? Oh yeah. 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 For Do our you younger know. listeners, this is all just in good fun. Santa is coming on Christmas Eve. Don't worry. <laughs> no, he's coming on Christmas. Well, he yeah. Santa's Christmas got the vaccine. Yeah. 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 No, so, he's yeah. fine. He's fine. He's yeah. not gonna like okay. spread anything into your house. He Everything was... is safe. They he's made sure quarantined. he was first in line. So. Yeah. He's been he got the vaccine whole life, first. So <laughs> celebrities get it first. Yeah, celebrities. <laughs> <laughs> all right that was fun but i think we should move on to recap the news hello everybody i'm Rody, and this is recap the year so with 2020 coming to a close and the new year's right around the corner i thought it'd be fun to play a little game where we can have the rest of the shower caps guess which month an event happened in. So I'll read a short description, and then the rest of you guys can guess which month it happened in. So to start off, we're going to start with something like a sort of easier event. So when did the election happen? April. <laughs> January. Uh, really? June? No. June 17th. Uh, I honestly I thought don't the, know. I thought the election was today, right. actually. Yeah. Oh. Technically, the election was like maybe three days ago. I don't oh, know do you, why, but oh yeah. yeah. Do you mean yeah. do you mean the bird election? Like might have went the bird election. Like do you mean the bird election from episode one? No. Oh, the bird election. Mm. Mm. No. Although that it's election was back, more important, and I'm it. talking about the presidential election. Oh, November. Uh, it, yeah, November. If, yeah. I, if I were to guess, November. November. <laughs> November. And that is right. It did happen in November. Now, when most people were inside quarantining already, their murder hornets came to America. Now, what month did that happen in? 
June. <laughs> April? June. Uh, April. I don't know this one actually. I think I think it was May. It was it, May. Yeah. Yes. Hey, oh what? my gosh, I'm still going to be on fire. Swedes on a roll. Yep. Dude. Now speaking of bugs invading us, in India there was an invasion of locusts in what month? Oh, oh, oh what? Oh, August? July? January, Every July. month. For Americans, we don't know what happens in other Saturday. Countries. Saturday. July. Uh, uh, there's July. no concept of uh, yeah, yeah, we are. <laughs> September. I don't know. March. Inva- invasion of what? Locusts. Locus. February? No, oh, that would happen in June. June. Oh, right. oh. Right. good job, Lou. <laughs> <laughs> now, this month was kind of scary. This was the month that Yummy by Justin Bieber was released. <laughs> April. January. Yeah, I would say January. Mm. Who's the believer in this? February. Group? Who is it? It I was February. February. Oh, yeah. no February. <laughs> Turbo's February. the believer, guys. Yeah. When everything started going downhill. Now this was a very <laughs> what? Des- oh, this was a very devastating event at six fourteen a.m. in this oh, month. No. Google crashed. It it was wait December today. <laughs> You just said this it month. Like, it was this month. December? December. <laughs> December. You said bro. this month. This <laughs> month. <laughs> you said this month. No, I think yes. she meant this. I think she meant this month as in like That's this specific. As in yeah. December. Oh, yeah. obviously. Uh, I'm still. This, well, not this month, but this month I'm going to talk about was kind of <laughs> sus. Now, among us, the. Uh, swept the nation and became very popular. What month was this? Was that October? September. July. July. Oh, September. September. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. What did you was that long ago? Bad game. It's I completely disagree. Yeah, sure. Shredder just hates all fun. Bad game. Shredder yeah. hates fun, guys. Shredder hates fun Shredder is cringe. Shredder, Shredder doesn't like good at it. Shredder thinks You're not good at it. Shredder Bad thinks game. everything is cringe. What is Shredder wrong with you guys? Oh, yeah. He thinks move everything on. is cringe. <laughs> move on. <laughs> all right, we're going to move on. Now, what month did the vacuum challenge happen? What's that? What? That was a what thing. Was when people friend? put themselves oh, in like plastic bag. bags and then like they sucked all the oh, air out of the vacuum. Oh. Um, February, it, March. February or no, 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 April. No, you already did. That April. was winter. That had to be winter. That was was it winter? January. January. It was January. Yes. Guys, bro, I remember that like 2019. Yeah. Is it just what me time? or does the month song just keep replaying in their head? Yeah. That's what's yeah. happening for me right now. Guys, one time my friend sucked up all my hair in a vacuum and it like ripped them out. <laughs> oh, Turbo. Uh, we nice. should make we that a time to unpack challenge. all of that right now. Oh, sorry. What month was that, Turbo? Wait, this is not therapy? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong call, sorry. <laughs> That's all right. Yeah, you're Turbo. supposed to be in mine too. <laughs> well, moving on to the next month, people thought the plague was coming back. March. March. <laughs> March. April. Wait. I no. think my parents March. were one of those people. No. August. It was March. It's March. November. It's not March. No, it's not. September. July. The plague. July. The plague. April. July. August. Oh, May? it's May? July. July. It was July. Good job, Lou. I said July. Oh, Lou, you are so low. I said it answer. more predominantly. <laughs> Lou, I no, said it first. no, I'm you not keep saying it like he's looking it up, being like, "Oh, it's this." Like you like <laughs> just read first. <laughs> I, I, I was thinking like, oh, you yes, get, if you rewatch, if you rewatch, I'm literally cheating. like, "Lou's got Lou cheat codes." He's cheating. <laughs> no, <laughs> I said it first. Ooh, that's but says. whatever. In this next month, Outer Banks created a whole new aesthetic and created the beaded hair trend. April. 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 It was April. April. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Got the oh, it's oh, so God. sad we all do that so fast. Oh, God. Oh, God. In this next month, there's the national state of emergency for the coronavirus. The stock market dropped. But most importantly, Tiger King came out on Netflix. March. 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 December. March. It Sunday, March. March, December, uh, Sunday. Sunday. <laughs> I feel like I just have March. no concept of time. Like I don't know what happened yeah. any month. Yeah, how like, is Christmas like literally like next week? Like tomorrow. 
Christmas is tomorrow. Oh, wow. Tomorrow. How is Chris said? How is it Christmas Eve, guys? What day does this episode come out? <laughs> First episode of 2021. Feels good. Happy what? New Year. Happy Easter. How is it? <laughs> <laughs> Can anyone remember what happened on Easter though? Like I don't remember it this no, year. I don't no. remember Easter either. Easter didn't happen. We, did. like, we just drove we just in the car it. for fun. That was fun. We Let's drove let in the Brody car for finish, Easter. guys. Let her keep going. Yeah, yeah. So in this next month, many fans mourn the loss of Chadwick <laughs> Boseman. Uh, August. It was August. August. It was August. 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 Good job, Swede. Wow, what? No way. We a so sad. So sad. <laughs> That's so far away. Like, I thought that was like yeah. last month. Hello. Who's mowing their lawn? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, who's trying to shave right now? <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry. Shredder. Shredder. I think it's a hard shaving <laughs> podcast. No special guest. I need to. <laughs> <laughs> The shaving cream podcast. <laughs> yeah. Rinse and repeat. They don't call us rinse and repeat for nothing, baby. <laughs> that genuinely Wait, look, scared me. We're gonna, we look at, at we're gonna cut that out. <laughs> oh, what is that? Is that? What is that? What is that? It's got to be someone's phone vibrating. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Wait. Give me, give me a test. There, sweet. Maybe we should just keep cutting her off. <laughs> I took oh. Out- oh, oh, you sound better you sound better i took out my headphones is that better yeah. a lot better mm-hmm. okay is it hard to- is it loud enough yeah if i'm not yeah. using them mm-hmm. it was okay. better than before okay. yeah what happened all right here we go so last but not least this was the month that positions by ariana grande came out but also this is also the month where claudy Got her signature bloody nose that gave her her name. Uh, I can't answer. October. Can I? Can I answer? October. 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 No, October. Tuesday. November. <laughs> I swear it was October. Bloody nose it it was. Day, yeah, it was actually. Yes, yeah, I knew it. Wait, was last what? month October? No. 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 Last month was November. This is Wait, what December. month? December. Actually, December. morning no, in the halls the of Lockport Township High School. Taylor, this month. October seventh. Yeah. Two what? p.m. I was literally yeah. sitting in lunch. And she was like, I got a bloody nose. We were like, go to the bathroom. She was like, no, I can't. I already went. So she sat there with a bloody nose and her mask was ugh, nasty. It was okay, so but nasty. then I was walking she around says, the hallway she... for like 20 minutes. And then a janitor stopped and he was like, do you need a new mask? And I was like, yes. And then he gave me a new one. Instant yes. clip here. Well, I think you rocked it. Yeah. Like, yeah. And now yeah. you see a photo on the screen of Claudie's bloody nose. No, Shout out to that, Janet. It's pretty graphic. Yeah. Well, I had a lot of fun reminiscing over all of the events that happened in 2020. And to be honest, I can barely remember a lot of them. Well, to be fair, I can barely remember what I ate for breakfast today or what I ordered on Amazon last night. Speaking of Amazon, let's throw it over to Yuke with Amazon Deep Dives. Cha-ching. It's Yuke. And I'm proud to present the segment, Amazon Deep Dives. A few of the Showercat members gave me a list of purchases they've made on Amazon. And I took it upon myself to dive into the depths of those reviews on the products and found the ones that no doubt convinced them to buy that product. First one, coming at us from Monster. Oh, God. (laughs) <laughs> hey a Hair dog down. pajamas with <laughs> yellow ducks on them whoa just and like shower cap kids because if you can't make your dog angry enough now you can put him in pajamas <laughs> she likes them <laughs> we got my dog like this track suit for christmas last year and when i do my gym outside for like my strava thing we take her with me in her little track suit Oh, so, yeah. well, that's adorable. Yeah. That's Monster, so what about, what about the review? What's them? on the review? The review <laughs> is from Delaney, and it was a five star review. And it says, "Looks great on my forty one pound mix. The head hole is a bit large and slips down her doggy shoulder blades, but I'm sure when we get around to washing it, that it should help shrink it. 
Super soft and keeps my baby warm when she needs to go out and potty at night. <laughs> My All dog right. does potty oh at night. Ooh, this seems like a this oh. middle-aged woman. Wrote this that. lady definitely this feels like child abuse. Stroller. I already know it. People, <laughs> yeah. People that refer to their dogs as like their babies. Oh my god. No, I, but um, I, I can't even start uh, with it. My baby I, can actually dog mom. you right now. So, <laughs> cat dad. I'm a cat dad. I used to um get my dog. I used to get her these um. Uh, little bow ties for the front of her hair, so we'd like tie little bow ties in the front, like ponytails. Oh, dog my, people, am I right? Horrible. My dog has Ew, to wear yeah. a whole entire jacket when he goes outside, like a whole like winter jacket. It's so embarrassing. <laughs> he looks. That's... Dog is so long. I mean, Taco's dog is so long. <laughs> yeah, Taco's <laughs> dog is a deer. He's little. What's your, what's your dog's long. name? Lettuce. Uh, no, actually, he is a racer. His his official name. Is flying tidal wave. It's so embarrassing. <laughs> oh my! <dang. laughs> Did you name him that? What? No, flying tidal no. wave. No, he raced for four years. He's a greyhound. He raced for four years, and so they were like, mm, "What's a great name?" They're like, "Flying tidal wave." I don't know how they came up with that. But what do you call him? him? Yeah, we, we call him Ty. Just Ty. T I. So like nobody has to know like my embarrassing family <laughs> secret of what our dog's name is. Does my family will know. Until when this goes viral, <laughs> everyone will know. <laughs> so wait, dog racing is real? What? Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's, that's okay. weird. While we're and at another, it, another product from Monster: a Bluetooth beanie with a built-in speaker. So that you can I have music. one. I have one. I'm not joking. I've I own this. one of those. Tumblr girls, and am I right? The review <laughs> is a four-star review from an engineering student. And it says, sound quality isn't bad, but isn't great either. When this first arrived, there was a very noticeable chirping background noise when no music was playing. Mm. I cracked the speaker open and wrapped the circuit board in electrical tape, and it solved the problem. Battery life is excellent, and the hat is pretty comfortable. I wear them to bed when my mentally unstable neighbor screams in the middle of the night and is far more comfortable than standard headphones. (laughs) It's not a good product if you have to break it open and fix it yourself. Yeah, how he talked about how he, like, was literally ripped it open and taped it, and then was like, no, it's great, though. Like, it's it's so great. Dang it, is now he I gotta, sure that the um, neighbor wasn't chirping? That it was the headphones? <laughs> yeah. Maybe it was Taco's bird. Maybe it was Taco's bird. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Poor it was now, Throw my bird in there. Now I have to walk over to my neighbor's house and apologize. <laughs> He's going to be all angry. <laughs> oh my God. And ask Dude, them these... to borrow some duct tape. Yeah. These beanies are like revolutionary. Like, I never heard of these. I want to buy one. They I are know. not that Kim, I mean, doesn't it hurt your ears? 21 oh. pilot stands, am I right? You said it was comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I can right. tell we're going to get sued by that neighbor. Okay. <laughs> I won't sue. Next product from Crasher. It's, you know, those banks with the faces on them and then it eats your money. No, those are so scary. <laughs> Two reviews. <laughs> Another yes. review from a Delaney with five stars. Pink and horrifying, right up my alley. I love this sucker. It sits there and judges me. It's sitting here and judging me now while I write this review. 10 out of 10, great companion. Just don't get on its bad side. And the second review from Jimmy H is three stars. Works great. Had to take off two stars because it murdered the rest of my family in their sleep. <laughs> I yes. told you they were scary. Pink and horrifying. The first review was monster. Pink and horrifying yeah. sounds familiar. Yeah. Sure. yeah. I have that effect on some people. <laughs> yeah, you know stars. Delaney was friends with Monster. <laughs> Three stars, even after it murdered his whole family. I mean, that's just a great mm. product. It's generous. <laughs> Maybe yeah. that's part of the reason he bought it. You never know. <laughs> oh. I feel he like it's been guilty. five stars then. Wait, is this four? <laughs> is this on a four or five star scale? Five. Oh, yeah. it's one what's on a four what's star a scale four star? <laughs> <laughs> is. who would purposely only use four stars <laughs> isn't that restaurants no 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 it's always no. five what or that's... Unless, unless it's like no. the little dollar signs then it like can go to four like that's how like you rate how like expensive they are i've seen that but only restaurants i've ever seen like five stars oh word what's the michelin star is that like for tires or am i <laughs> 
Oh, I don't. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, what? Three that is for tires. Oh. Yes. No. Wait, what is it actually for? Like super, for? It's super, for it's for restaurants. restaurants. Oh, okay. It's I, it's for I like it was yeah. <laughs> yeah. The smaller the food, the better. That's for sure. And mm-hmm. Then it gives you more stars. If you okay. get like a bean on a plate, then you know it's and good. And for our last product, it is called the Handy Horse. You know those like finger puppets? It's a horse, but like for your fingers. Taco, Five star review from Whizbang72 says, Great fun and a superb addition to my ever growing finger puppet family. Nice, flexible material. Should be around a long time. His name is Candy Corn. And has taken nicely to his new brothers, Peppercorn and Mr. Nibbles. Update. Candy Corn and Peppercorn have made a lifelong commitment. And they were wed in a simple ceremony at their favorite local watering hole. <laughs> Before <laughs> any of you say anything, I did not buy this. Okay, I don't Taco, don't say anything. <laughs> Come on. Their name is and Peppercorn, though. The story was kind of beautiful, though. I name it. <laughs> yeah. It kind of gets, me, gets yeah. me a little emotional. So that felt illegal to hear. Yeah. <laughs> kind of wish I was invited. Finally, a relationship that will last. Yes. <laughs> love story of the ages. Put that ring on the hoof. Oh. Ooh. Okay, well, I think we've all had fun analyzing these interesting purchases that Shower Cat members have made. But I think it's time to move on and learn a little bit more about the Shower Cat kids. Next up is Who's at Shower Cat? Who's that? Shower Cap Kid. Yeah, in this game, we will describe a secret Shower Cap member, and you guys are going to have to guess who that person is. Uh, I'm going to give you guys four clues to figure out uh, who the person is, and this will also help the audience figure out, you know, learn a little bit more about us. So uh, our first person is definitely going to be on Santa's nice list. Um... So just shout out, like, if you have an answer. That's so not, it's uh, not Solo. Olivia. I mean, oh, God. <laughs> nope. Swede. And then this person oh. also has, uh, this person has craft mom energy, some might say. And uh, not the PTO type mom type craft energy, though, like the essential oil type energy, like the Ew. like the hippie kind of mom vibes. It's this is Rody. It's Rody. No, this is Rody. It's Rody. It's Rody. It's Rody a thousand percent. Nobody some, thinks some other, uh, <laughs> no? some other things is uh, this person would kindly give both of their kidneys just because someone asked nicely. Oh, oh yeah, Rody. Yeah, it's Rody. that's solidifying my answer. And then the final yeah. one, uh, they uh, intentionally threw tinfoil into a microwave. <laughs> oh, that's me! <laughs> it's Rody! It's Rody, okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> yes, great job. It was Rody. So, uh, are you are you proud of almost exploding a microwave? What What is this? It was this microwave in fifth grade. I didn't like her. <gasps> See, I wouldn't would, would, would pin you for a PTO mom, but I guess essential oil mom also works. <laughs> yeah, microwaves are a little expensive, Rody. Wherever okay, you are. Next up, uh, no. next person. So uh this person is uh some uh, some people say that he uh that they are naughty. Uh <laughs> Naughty. Oh, I, know, I know who it is. Naughty. Oh. <laughs> they, give, uh, they give off food critic energy. Echo. Lou. It's Lou. This, this is Lou. Lou. This yeah, is Lou. Lou. I don't know. Uh, this one, these are going to start to give it away. Uh, they keep their mouth shut, but are probably uh, behind everyone back plotting to rule the entire world. It's lemonade. Got some nefarious. It's lemonade, yeah. Uh, lemonade. lemonade. Food? Yeah. Wait, lemonade. what? Lemonade, lemonade definitely has, like, a notes page in their phone of, like, a hit list. Like, Wait, <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. Lemonade has all of our addresses. You, to- <laughs> lemonade, you can confess. Yeah. We won't judge. And then just to confirm it, uh, they won the award for the biggest bust a move. Yep. Yep. Oh, lemonade. So yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. oh, oh yeah. 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 Busted a move. <laughs> I, I did think it was weird how Lemonade asked for my social security number. I thought that was weird. Like, mm-hmm. yeah, but, but you gave it to him. You weren't supposed to. I don't know. I did give it to him. Yes. <laughs> okay. Next. Uh, next person. This person is also naughty. This person has watched so much TikTok that they can no longer distinguish what's fake and what's real, and they just think that everything is about their for you page. 
Hmm. Well, now it's so low. What's wrong with this guy? Let's let's hear it. Let's hear more. So the next one is uh, this person would try and start a Quidditch team at Lockport, but we oh, get shut no. down. It's no, it's Felton. It's, it's Felton. Felton. You guys are right. It's Felton. Uh, <laughs> I mean, that would be pretty dope, though. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> right. That would, though. Guys, I I'll see, be in the uh, I'll run around in a gold costume. Like, <laughs> you'll never catch me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, great game, guys, but... Uh, no, oh, one more. One more. Uh, one more. Just reset. Go one more if you got... Do you have another one? We don't have another one. Just someone make one up. <laughs> make one up. Someone make one up. Okay, uh, great game, guys, but I think it's time to head it over, give it over to Monster for our closing. Well, thank you very much. But wait a minute. What are we going to title this episode? Oh. Um, yes, oh, who's man. coming to town? Santa Claus. <laughs> Solid suggestion. <laughs> yeah okay i'll i'll make note of that, cool. that in the idea box you think <laughs> we could we could name we'll it let um, that sit we could name it lemonade's manifesto what do you think <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, so funny. lemonade no, no. <laughs> lemonade Bell. Let, let's, let's name lemonade it Bell. i said name it in my brain and then i didn't want to say it out loud <laughs> guys what about santa we have to honor this episode to santa yeah. All right, Santa, oh, Santa yeah. as the um, uh, Amazon delivery driver. Yeah. Oh. And Santa works for Amazon this Christmas. Yeah. This Christmas? Yeah. Oh, we can't say that. Santa's the imposter. Giddy Mall Santas. Giddy Mall Santas. Giddy Mall Santas. That's pretty good. I like Skinny Mall Santas. Skinny Mall Santa. Skinny Mall Santa. All right. Yeah. Well, it sounds like we have our name, guys. Were we all elves on the shelves? Did you all get the matching costumes and the little hats and the? Yes, the I already yes. had it. I didn't need to get anything. Hats. Yeah, Echo has his. It's just in a different room. Yeah. No, my yeah. ears are really pointy. I can pass. <laughs> oh, good. All right, all right. So we've got at least one elf on the shelf, guys. That's a one out of fifteen. That wouldn't pass the test, but that's okay. We'll we'll get to it next week. Yeah, you know, guys, come late on. Late Christmas. Really? Too shaky to be a elf on the shelf. Hey, mm-hmm. Santa loves us all anyway. <laughs> this is real. This is real. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, thank you to everybody for listening to Rinse and Repeat with the Shower Cat Kids. We do this ep- we do this podcast once we Oh. <laughs> God. <laughs> yes. Sorry, my anyway, this is this really this a week. Week. Well, thank you everybody for listening. This has been Rinse and Repeat with the Shower Cap Kids, and we record this podcast just like we question the existence of Santa Claus once a week. Now, though we do come to you once every week, we're going to take a little bit of a break for a while for the new year, but make sure you keep an eye out for a special episode coming to you soon for Rinse and Repeat. Now, thank you to everybody for listening, and good night to you, Mr. Marciniak, and to everybody else... Have a night. He does look like Santa, doesn't he? Santa's real. Same room. Santa is real. Yup. Santa. I lost connection.